We're back again with a game show episode part two. As promised, we're back with the game show episode of Old School Moomers. Let me hear them horns. There we go. So, um, yeah, let's get into the weekend game shows. So, like, you know, you had your shows coming on. When you saw the LWT sign, da -da -da, yeah. London da -da -da. I remember when I was little, <laughs> Friday, Friday night, after getting fish and chips, you know when you queue up in the chip shop to get, yeah. your, get your Friday junk food, get your fish and chips, Come home, sit down, you know, you got your ginger beer or your lilt or whatever, you know, your top deck. Pear jacks. Yeah, top deck, pear jacks, you know, quattro. Put it on the TV and you hear, bam ba dam ba bam ba dam ba LWT looking like Colgate, the, yeah. you know, the, 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 red, the red, white and blue logo. And then straight after that you hear, <laughs> and you knew bloody play your cards right was coming yeah. on man do you remember that Mate. and he was like oh this is love it. play your cards right. <laughs> and when you at, like bruce Forsyth, he was he was just like he was like it was like the dawn of weekend yeah entertainment like the king game of, show king of quiz shows isn't he, man? 100 percent. do you know what 100%. i mean and he took that he took that nice to see to see you all the way through every show he went on yeah mm. yeah you know he, I mean? he, he done two run-ins of Play Your Cards Right, didn't he? He done it in the in the early 80s. Yeah, he came back. Yeah, he done it again. three run-ins. He come back in the 90s, he came back again in, in the in the noughties. Because it, it was the typical, it was the typical show. Mm. It's a typical show that you could like, everyone could play. It was high or low. What's yeah. your choice? Yeah. Do you want them to go? Yeah. It was simple as that. 50-50. Yeah. No confusion, no, do you know what I mean? Let's just, let's just get through this. High and ace. High and ace. <laughs> oh, mate. You can't get two for a pair, not in this not game. Not in this game, mate. Not in this game. It could still be a good night if you play your cards. Oh, right? mate, and, and um, he, had his, he had his dollies, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. These yeah. girls are so appealing, so dollies, do your dealing. <laughs> Come out with their cards. They, mate, I used, to, I used to rap everything. Yeah, yeah. And he used to get the, the audience involved, you know, what the points make. Prizes. Prizes. Yes. <laughs> we all done it. We were at home yeah, six yeah. that. Do you remember yeah. advert? Don't touch the pack, we'll be right back. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I love that little science. Oh, that was big. That was a big that one. Was Don't big. touch the pack. Yes. <laughs> Don't touch the pack. We'll be right back. There was another another funny thing. Right, right at the start, he used to come in, introduce himself, and he, he'd say to the audience, you're so much better than last week. Yes, yeah, and yeah. The yeah. funny thing is, because they would shoot like five episodes in one, in go. one go. So yeah. it's the same audience. Yeah, you know yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That, and that's probably why they were laughing they so much. Good, yeah. Yeah. That's why they got it's a good... Like, that good goes exactly again. that. That was magical television, though, Pay Cards yeah. Right. Yeah. Like, Bruce yeah. Forsyth, he, he, he knocked out the park with that one. As I said, from a, from a kid to, to when I was getting older, I was still watching that show. Yeah. Yeah. And if yeah, it came yeah. back now, you know, I'll still yeah, watch that show again. I'd watch it. Play Cards Right, Bruce Forsyth, you can't beat that. So, carrying on with the... Weekend shows. We had prices right, but second to that, it's got to be Family Fortunes, man. Family, family Fortunes, fortunes. Is a great show. Family Fortunes. Family fortunes Do you good. remember? I, I remember my first host. What my f the first host I saw was Max Bygraves. Uh, okay, yeah. I want to tell you a story. Yeah, yeah. Max Bygraves. Max Bygraves. Bob Monkhouse was before. Eight, he done eighty to eighty three. I remember Bob Monkhouse. Then yeah. Max Bygraves eighty three to eighty five. Yeah. Then it started getting rubbish. Les Dennis. Les De no, no, it was still oh, a no, good no, show. No, 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 no. It didn't start getting. No, I stick yeah. by that show, man. Yeah, definitely. Oh, I didn't. I, didn't no. I, I fell out of love with it with Les. No, no, no because no. the questions, the, the whole gameplay. I, the, yeah. As long as I it still see changed. the bit at the end where changed. people say something and then you got to say it but not say mm. the same thing. Yeah. Like place to go on holiday. You know, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. The, 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 the game, the, the mate, the way it's set is wicked. The way it's set. I mean, yeah, I don't, I don't, it was such I don't a good game. Hosting, it's like, who, yeah, yeah no, I don't I, mind Vernon K hosting it. it it's, yeah, it's, yeah. He's better than Les sure. Dennis. It's, for me. It's, I got too much. Fortunes. Les Dennis is too much uh, doing a Mavis impression every minute. I, I don't mind, man. I don't, that I just is watch, true. That is I don't true. Mean. Well, I don't know, really. Yeah. No, he's like, he's doing that too that much. Yeah. Very, I, very I understand. Like, I'll just get on with it, man. Where's Max Bygraves? <laughs> I understand. I want to tell you a story. Bring him back. He was better. He died. That's why I can do it. Did he? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I know he died, but I didn't know he died. That's too, why. But <laughs> maybe. But <laughs> another big thing I remember about it. Yeah, that wouldn't have been good bringing him. But the other good thing I remember about it was you remember the if you got something wrong. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. He's a love the noise. <laughs> Mate, you got that and wrong. It, and, and sometimes you would, you would, you would, you would attach yourself to a certain family. Like, no, I want that family yeah, I want to that win. Family to and you didn't yeah, want yeah. that family to, go, yeah. eh, eh, to get free exes. <laughs> and you remember, if you got free exes, that your money automatically <laughs> goes, goes yeah, to the other family. Up. They oh, could have done rubbish. They could have done all, rubbish. All, all, all yep. show they could have done rubbish. All they needed was that one question. They take yeah. a lot. But, but some people were real stupid on that program. Yeah. Some of the 
because some of the answers they would give, and even the public, the public, yeah, some of their answers for the board mm. were like, just, oh, ah, yeah. just it was stupid. But as I said, the bit at the end, where where you have to say five things, do you know what I mean? Mm. I used to like that bit actually. Yeah. You know, that, that bit, bit was good. You know, yeah. that um, bit was good. And that, and, and I'm sure but, people, I'm sure I've read, but it was that harder for the other person. Families yeah. rigged that. There was a way, like the the, the production company I hadn't thought, but there was a way of like answering doing the answers alphabetically. So if you were to answer like, what is your favorite country? You would try and answer an A, I would try and do a B. So we mm. never get the same. There was mm. something I remember reading, they thought, oh, we're like, we didn't we didn't realize families were gonna do that. But mm. Some of the families were smart and they'd worked out mm. how they were gonna use little tricks to not say the right thing and stuff. But uh-huh. the concept of That's the show good. was was good though. I can't, what were the yeah. prizes like? With the prizes, I can't remember. There were the big prizes. prizes. Like you win a holiday cast. Uh, yeah, you yeah, you get a, a, a star prize. Woo, woo, woo. Yeah, make a star noise. Prize would yeah. be the holiday. Or remember, whoa, 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 prizes whoa. throughout, wouldn't they? If you, <laughs> yeah. say, if you say the star question, whoa, 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 yeah. whoa, whoa. <laughs> you've won a weekend in somewhere. Yeah, yeah. yeah. A spa for two. A spa for two. Yeah. Yeah. A decanter. Yeah. You remember that? Always winning decanters, mate. Family fortunes. That was a show, man. Yeah. Mate, I love Family Fortunes. Uh, what, was, what was the theme tune? Do you know what? I don't even know. It wasn't. Something like that. Something like that. But, um, <laughs> but you know, I was saying Bruce Forsyth, man. He was king. He was king. Price is Right was wicked. That was a really good game show. Price is Right. Price is Right. Who who hosted that? Leslie Crowder. Leslie Crowder. From for our, for our generation. And he called her name. Yeah. Yeah. And he come right yeah. again. It's an American oh, yeah, game show. Right. That day. Yes. Because you know in America they go wild on that. Yes. Kind of thing. I, I remember, I remember Price is Right. It was big. When he used to say, come on down, they had different type music. went, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 People used to run yeah, down there. Mad excited. I, I, I still, I'm not being cynical, but I still want people to fall down. To the drop, stage. yeah. <laughs> like, that would have been or, great TV. Or, or, like, or, if or you, tit to flop out. Or tit to flop out, yeah. <laughs> 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 come on, I was a kid. Please drop or please flop out. Please drop or please flop out. Boop, pop out. That was like the ultimate. It seemed like America had come. Yeah. When I first saw that, it was like, oh, American TV's yeah. coming up. We've got the prices. Yeah. Yeah. I, I saw the American version before the English version came out. Don't, yeah. I don't know Was how. it the same title? I think I it might have been. Know. Or it was, that might have been called like Come On Down or something. See, or that's like, what I was thinking. Because Come, Come On, on Down, down yeah. rings quite a lot of bells. Mm. Yeah, it's Saturday The American night. version was crazy. So Come On like, Down, the price they is were, right. You know, well, I, I, they were I, I, super seen, excited. I've seen the American version. Mm. I've seen yeah, yeah, it's super but, excited. That's yeah, and I had a lot of nice games. Is this the American version or is this like... No, this is a UK version. I think the boob did come out on the American version. Yeah, that's what I said. What's that program, Be Alright in the Night? In this next clip, if you just watch a boob... I saw it on. But so yeah. looking back at it now, it's quite a tame show. But back then, it was wild. Like it was wild, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah it was yeah. a wild show. But now it seems quite tame to some Leslie of the Crowder. some of the shows we got out now. Yeah, yeah. But that that was also produced by William G. Stewart, fifteen to one. Oh, he produced. He, produ- he produced that. Well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and he was known at the start to come out um, to get the, the audience cheered up, and he'd come out to the tune of "Land and Hope and Glory." Wearing a, a, a pink tracksuit, jumping around the stage. That guy off the fifteen to one bloke. Oh wow! I didn't, <laughs> that, I didn't know about that. No, I only oh, read that wow. recently. But yeah, you had enough kings. You had enough um, um, hosts and enough, you know. But Bruce Forsyth, other than Price is Right, he done other shows. He done Generation yeah, Games, Generation Generation Game. Game. and yeah. Larry Grace. That was Larry Grayson for, for me as well. I like um, Larry Grayson. But he done other shows, didn't he? he done, Bruce he, Forsyth. He used to do loads yeah. of stuff. I mean, like, he, he, he was a dancer. No, but I'm talking about game, his game shows. Yeah, I he don't remember those two, but I'm sure he did. He done a lot. He done a lot. He done a lot of others at the time. Another guy who who who, who was emerging on the scene, Michael Barrymore, Strike mm, It Lucky. Strike, strike It Lucky. Lucky. He's good. Yeah. And that and that was like that 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 you know that host that presenter that took the pee out of the contestants and yeah. you know and, and played along with them and, and tried to get them to win like gave them the answer on the yeah, sly and stuff. Yeah. And, you know, and was making funny faces at the crowd and at the t- TV, and you know, he, he was he, funny. He, he, was, he, he knew how to engage the yeah, crowd. Yeah. You know, um, it was top, middle, or bottom, wasn't it? Well, strike it lucky. Yeah. 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 Top, middle, or bottom. Yeah. Yeah. Ben, it was, ben, hot, ben, was ben, a hot ben, spot. Ben, 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 ben. It was a hot spot. And that, that was like, yeah, 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 I did like that. And he done one and more games, mm. one more than one game show, didn't he? <laughs> but look, a game show that I love, and this, yeah, and this game show was only for Saturdays. Did see any other day of the week? Only for Saturdays, it was a top show. 
because it had singing in it, had dancing in it, had little like plays in it, but it had a bin in it, and that was the attraction. <laughs> it had a bin in it. And this bin yeah. was the attraction of the show. This bin it was the booby prize. Was the booby prize, yeah. and it's what people wanted mm. in the show. And that was three, two, one, man. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. one. It was a classic game. Dusty bin. Wicked. I wanted a Wicked. dusty bin. Everyone wanted a dusty bin. Everyone wanted a dusty bin. Everyone yeah. wanted a dusty bin. Everyone wanted a dusty bin. Everyone wanted a Everybody wanted a dusty bin. So it ran for 10 years, and it was it was one of the biggest 16.5 million viewers uh, at, at its height, it, but it averaged 12 million every week for 10 years. 12 million wow. viewers. Man. Everybody three, two, thought one. they could do the three, two, one hand move. Oh, yeah, everyone used to try that. Yeah. Everybody. Ted, Ted, Ted Rogers? Ted Rogers. Reminds me of Buck Rogers. Yeah, yeah. Ted Rogers. And Dusty Bin. And Dusty but yeah, it was a weird show because he would, oh, he, he would interview the contestants and they'll say where they're from and that. And then there'll be a scene like they're, they're in Spain and then some singers will start singing and dancing. <laughs> yeah. Then they go back to the contestants, they'll ask them, they tell them a riddle and they have to work yeah, out yeah, the riddle. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't remember. And then, remember and then he bit. would sing yeah, with a band. No. Yeah, oh, but on the oh, bandstand, and Dusty Bin will roll in in <laughs> costume. He'll have like, a Mexican costume, he'll have yeah, a spaceman like, costume, a oh, golf outfit. They had all different, yeah, what are you doing all today, different Dusty? Outfits, yeah. And he'll understand Dusty. Yeah. Dusty wouldn't be talking, but he's he'll like just his be like, too, wouldn't it? It was like yeah, PPR, yeah, he'd just wheel in. <laughs> And, uh, but that was the attraction as a kid. Yeah, it was all about I, the bin. I remember my mum calling me to say, "Look, Darren, Dusty bin's Dusty on." Dusty bin's on. So, yeah. Yeah. so you can run in the room. It was either that or Metal Mickey. Yeah, yeah. Get yeah. yeah. Come and look at these. Come and look at. Like, but just his it's scenes. Fucking bin, like. And, and then go. Yeah. So I yeah. didn't really watch Three, Two, One. I just watched Dusty yeah. bin. Dusty bin bits. And then go back and out. Back and back out. Like, I remember yeah. the riddle bit, like you said though. And remember yeah. the riddles. You, yeah, yeah. You, you would catch that if you stayed in the room for a bit. If you said, "Okay, I bring my, I carry on playing my toys in the in the front room." Right, it's just the Dusty bin bit. And they bin to. Yeah. And see him do the hand move. Yeah. Proper bin dip bin. Eh? <laughs> the what? Bin dip bin. Bin dip bin. Dip into the bin bits. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. The, 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 and, the and the three, two, three, two, the three, two, one, yeah. Which you kind of like because you could do your own two and the one. Yeah. With your hands. But I, I, I don't know the magnitude of the prizes. I can't remember the magnitude of the prizes. No, no. So, but, but I say the bin, the hand move. <laughs> I don't good. ever remember Ted Rogers doing anything before or after either. I only know him from, from yeah. 321. 321. But he's probably, uh, yeah, as, you, as we were saying, a lot of them were on the circuit, you know, mm. uh, stand up comedians or entertainers and that, and they were mm. ones that got all the jobs, man. They did. Saying that, you you're saying about Forsyth, he, he originally presented, do you remember a show called You Bet? Yeah. Which oh, we yeah. know it from, who presented it and how? I yeah. can't remember, but I do know the title. Is it Les? Matthew, no. Was it Matthew Kelly and how? Yeah, yeah, Matthew, Matthew, yeah, Matthew Kelly. Matthew Kelly done it. I remember that. Wasn't that like a? It's almost like a stunt show, wasn't it? Like they got celebrities yeah. to do stunt, or they had to bet on stunts. A, if they got it wrong, the celebrity would have to do the stunt. But it, yeah. some of them, like, like it could be like walking out of a, on a wing of a plane. Yes. Or, that was, was the for, that was the forfeit. Oh, was so forfeit, someone would come in yeah. and say, "I can smash thirty eggs on my head in." Yeah, in yeah 10 that was seconds. it. It was something. And yeah. you have to bet whether he can or can't do it. And if, if you got it wrong, you have to do then they would do something really extreme. Yeah, sort of like, extreme for them days anyway. Yeah. But I used to like you, but, but that was that another was good, one. I remember, yeah, you I remember Brucey really. first presenting it, eighty-eight to ninety. So that was you know prime time for our days. It's prime time. <laughs> prime time. And then <laughs> Ma Matthew Kelly, ninety-one to ninety-five, which you yeah. know. Yeah. Do you remember the theme tune to that? No, no. It's another one. I've done a bit of work on it. I remember, I think it was filmed in Manchester. And I was working up there at the time, and that was one of the sets that I worked on, you bet, because I remember getting some props and sort of freebies off of them, T-shirts and what, mm. whatnot. Okay. Now, another game show, Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Fortune. That's a good game. Who presented that one? one? That was Nicky Campbell, wasn't it? Was it Nicky Campbell? Okay. Yeah. Wheel of Fortune, yeah, Nicky Campbell. And yeah. Carol Smiley. Was it Carol Smiley as well, that one? Am I getting confused? No, we, we, that was when, you, when they pulled the wheel round, the wheel round, wasn't it? Yeah, it was when they spun yeah. it. Yeah, that that was um, Carol Smiley Carol and Smiley. and and what's uh, what's his name? And Nikki Campbell. Nikki Campbell. And if I remember, Smiley when she went off to do changing rooms, it got replaced by. Do you remember Jenny? Powell? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. She re she replaced oh, her. Yeah. Remember Jenny oh, okay. Powell doing it as well, yeah. and she carried on, and Bradley Walsh took over from Nikki Campbell later on. And Jenny stayed with with Nick with Bradley Walsh in the end, and that was another yeah, big prize good. show, right? Big really prizes, yeah, yeah, it was a big but, money prize. But, I think, but, right? but, yeah, but it was. But you see that, see that that contrast there. I, I remember ITV used to give big prizes, mm. and BBC gave best, nothing. Best. Yeah. And, and the ultimate show from BBC that give you nothing was blankety blankety blank. Blankety blank. That's what blank. you would get in it. You would a get checkbook blank and pen, blank. a blankety blank checkbook, a checkbook and pen. pen. Yeah, super match like. game, super match <laughs> game, super match game. <laughs> Super match game, <laughs> like 
again. That ran for 20 years. The host held, held that up. Held that, yeah, Les Dawson. definitely. Yeah. And then yeah, Terry funny. Wogan later, wasn't Terry it? Terry Wogan but, and Les Dawson yeah. were both great hosts for that. Yeah. Now, I remember it more from the Terry Wogan days. And I always remember him having, like, Kenny Everett on there. And he used to snap his big, long wand microphone that he had. Remember, he used to have that mm. long... Oh, yeah. Kenny oh, Everett yeah. always, straight away yeah. at the start of the show, he'd call yeah. him over, snap his microphone. rest of the show, he'd be walking around with a snap microphone. <laughs> yeah, blankety blank. And you had to fill in the blank, innit? Yeah. yeah. So, you know, old Deirdre went to the pub the other day, but she left the blank, the blank at home. Yeah. 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 It, it was always innuendos yeah. that come out, wasn't it? It was proper. It was proper 70s. Yeah. Ran to the 90s though. 1970 to 1990. I'm surprised it lasted that long. But it was good. It was good. It was good. Yeah. It was good. Yeah. It was good. I always good. remember Lorraine Chase was on it. Like I say, yeah. Kenny Everett, Paul Daniels and his missus used to be on yeah. it. Yeah. It was them sort of, sort of. Yeah. Or, or one of Little Large or One of Little Large. Yeah. Little Large. Yeah. I forgot about those two. Wow. That was good. Uh, like, but like you say, yeah, a blankety blank. That was the star prize. Yeah, because really, BBC weren't, blank. weren't letting off anything. Nah. Yeah. They, they felt you coming on the BBC is... That was the privilege. That's your, uh, yeah, that's the like, prize. Like another show on Saturday is Telly Addicts. Noel Evans. Telly Addicts, Telly Addicts, Telly Addicts is a good show. That was good. Yeah, was yeah. Good. that was good. That was man. two normal, normal families, Family, wasn't it? just watching mm. Telly watching and clips and clips then talking and questions and about... And what, yeah, and questions in, like, what happened in that clip. Yeah, what jumper was the cat wearing... Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, I don't know good. the prizes. No, I can't, I can't remember, remember the prizes. The prizes. I think, I'm thinking again, it was probably good. But it was a good show. Oh, because... Wasn't Teddy Addicts on midweek? No, it's Saturdays. That's no, one of, yeah. It it's like, it's only a time. game, so the yeah. Big break. Yeah, it was one around that time. Like, Teddy <laughs> yeah, Addicts, yeah, Big Break. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big, <laughs> big yeah. Break was good. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I, I didn't watch Big Break. I, well, I, like, big I like Big Break. Big Break was good. Yeah, if Jimmy White was on it, then yeah, definitely watching it. Yeah. Big Break. Teddy Addicts one, that was good. So good. um, you mentioned earlier, didn't you mentioned Generation Game earlier. That was old Larry Grayson from our era. I think um, there's been a few people do, done the Generation. Another Brucey one. Generation yeah, that's game, Brucey, yeah. Brucey he's done and Larry. It, he's done it before and after. Larry, Larry. Grayson was shut that yeah. door. His catchphrase. Yeah, his, his yeah. catchphrase. Yeah, yeah. And the conveyor belt with a cuddly toy. But I used to try and confuse you and show you like, like um, a washing machine. <laughs> A new stereo, a cuddly toy. A cuddly toy, always a cuddly and a, toy. And a, a lawnmower, a vacuum cleaner, a cuddly toy. But the uh, thing is, you had to remember the items. Yeah. yeah. If you remember you the items on the conveyor belt, you'd keep. Yeah, so, yeah. so keep saying cuddly toy will make you forget. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Do you but, remember to get to the, to the conveyor belt round, you had to do... You had to, I think they were split up. It was couples again. No, it was generations, wasn't it? Like a grandma and a grandchild or yeah. a father and daughter. That was the generation part. But they, to get to the to the conveyor belt round, you, they'd have to do rounds where a professional in some field of something would come in and either make something or yeah, do something. That's right. And they would get two uh, minutes to try and do it. To do this, yeah. To try and do the same. Like it might be yes. wallpaper or ceiling. Yeah, so yeah, they yeah, know yeah, it's yeah, going to yes, be yeah. hilarious. Yes, like, yes. I used to love that bit, Good man. entertainment. Or make right. a cake or something, make innit? A or decorate a wedding cake. Yeah. I was going to say decorate yeah. a wedding cake would be another thing. But yeah. that's where... Um, Oh, Bruce's catchphrase was good game, good game. That's where that come from. Yes, right, of course. Yes. And didn't they do well? Didn't they do, yeah. didn't they that do was well? That was from, it was from that. So that's 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 pretty much Saturday night entertainment wrapped mm. up. Entertained, bursting of energy. But you had to go to school Monday, so they gave you an injection of shows on Sunday. Now Sundays, daytime coming to five six o'clock is when I first saw catchphrase. Now, catchphrase, catchphrase was the first time we saw it. Was it Roy Walker Roy and Mr. Chips? Mr. Chips. <laughs> I actually thought it was on around seven mm. on a Sunday. Yeah, it was around that time. Yeah. Around from six to yeah, seven, six around to that seven. time. Yeah. And yeah. Um, catch, see, seeing that, that, that's a show you thought, how's this show going to work? Because in them days, it was actual yeah, catchphrases. Catch yeah. Mm. Now, it proper catch it's just like, <laughs> hey, that's not a catchphrase. Yeah, isn't it? That's a celebrity. What is it saying? That's just <laughs> yeah, a word. Exactly. Yeah, it's, 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 you're really struggling now. You're really struggling for catchphrases. For catchphrases, man. But back in the day, when you, <laughs> you know the square, <laughs> you know, that's the sound. Do they still have that sound? Yeah, oh, yeah, it sounds like. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mate, that that catchphrase is one that got me, man. Was that, did that start in the 90s? I wasn't 80, 86. 86. 86 to 99. 50 pounds, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> a thousand pounds, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, right. And he used to tell he the, he he the, the corniest of jokes at the end. Remember yeah, every yeah. comedian told joke. you a joke? But yeah. remember, Roy Walker was on that circuit again yeah. doing the variety shows. Yeah. Yeah. And he was that dry sense of yeah. human. Yeah. It's human. Sense of <laughs> sense of, sense of human, dry, dry, dry sense of humour comedian. <laughs> you, know, you know the comedians that didn't laugh at their jokes, just, mm. just yeah. there. And I remember he used to tell the corniest jokes at the end. They go, 
Good night, everyone. <laughs> You're like, did he just try and tell a joke there? <laughs> he covered it up with good night, yeah, everyone. Yeah. Ah, uh, he's the corniest, corniest <laughs> ever. But him and Mr. It Chips, worked. It worked. Yeah, well. They worked yeah. like a glove. It worked. Well. Also, say what you I think see. it was one of the first to have like that. Like, say what you see. To have say like the computer see. technology. Yeah, on you know, yeah. the big screen. The TV yeah. screens. And a little music when Mr. Chips would do it. Look yeah. at Mr. Chips. Look at Mr. Chips doing. <laughs> What's, What's he doing? doing? What's he doing? <laughs> <laughs> Mate, I love that. I don't know what I think he's doing. I just can't yeah. say it. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it all the time. Yeah, it? I love, but do you remember another show presented by Mike Aspel? Um, on a sun, I think it was on a Sunday. He done a good couple, didn't he? Child's that? play. Child's mm. play. When they got kids yeah. to describe something, there's yeah. there a bunch of celebrities, you know, in pairs, yeah. and kids would describe a theatre, and kids like five years old will say, <laughs> "Yeah." And it, do, you know, do you remember that show? <laughs> it was wicked. That was, I loved and it. And we were young as well, it. so yeah, yeah. seeing kids do it, you think sometimes yourself, oh, "I wouldn't mind doing yeah, that." Yeah. You know what I mean? I wish they'd come yeah. to our school because it was like all school kids, wasn't it? Yeah, they went to schools. Yes, school kids. And if you did schools, yes. Well, it used to be a, a, a member of the public and a celebrity as as the team, I think. Was it a member of the public? Yeah, oh, I, I think it was a two public and a celebrity oh, okay. public. I think there might have been three teams or four teams, but yeah, that was wicked. Charles, Charles Play was wicked. Play. I used to love Charles Play, man. Around that 84 to 88. That, that Did run. it? Yeah. So yeah 75 that, episodes. I loved it. I loved it. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, Sunday nights, man. Sunday nights, Charles Play. <laughs> Charles Play. Um... A catchphrase, <laughs> but to end your night, to end your night, there was two shows that would come on to end your night, and um, no order. I can't remember what what times and orders these went in, but there were two that really stood out, right? So you had That's Life that won a game show. That's it was a show that had mm. bits in it. Remember That's Life, Esther like Anson? That's show. Life, yeah. Yeah, that, that, that was, was like later, later on. Yeah, that was that like was nine o'clock. Touching with Spitting Image, yeah. like to yeah. yeah. Spitting Image kind yeah. of. Helen that. Pace, That's Life. Yeah. But it, it, it was that zone, was but there was an in between zone, yeah? And that in between zone, there's two shows that I loved watching. That's Bullseye and Blind Date. So let's go to Bullseye. Bullseye. Now, Bullseye. Bullseye had the animation. Had the animation. Darts was a big... So it's, a, it's a dart show. Everybody it's had a dart ball at some yeah. point. I think yeah. dart ball may have been a slight like Christmas massive, present. Or something. Man. Someone in your family it was a had a dart yeah. ball. Yeah. Yeah. Like everyone... Yeah. You know, but but, but, but the thing is, I'd never been into a pub. Mm. But yeah. Bullseye, yeah, we know Bullseye, dart. I saw a dart ball. And Woolworths smashed it. With, yeah. with sales of dart balls. Yeah, yeah. definitely. It's everybody, like the proper the darts, you know, yeah. like the metal, Every, everyone metal has a bike one, heavy yeah. darts. Yeah. Not the Velcro type. Not, yeah. The don't hurt when you drop them. Mate, a dart. And everyone always stick it to a door and not mm. worry about someone so opening the door. Through. No. That was never in your mind to think. <laughs> or, or how so, many times you might miss and put holes in the door as well. Yeah, <laughs> that wasn't a problem. Like, it, it needs to be on the door. Let's, why didn't anybody ever put it on the wall? Why did we all put it on the door? On the door. I had mine on the wall. The but... on the wall. I didn't have it on the Eventually. I made a massive yeah, hole in the wall. Back the door. Yeah, but when you just had that without the um, chalkboard and shit, yeah. just the round thing, mm. mate, it, it was always back, on the door. It was always on the door, back of the door. Back of the, back of the door, mate. I love yeah. that, but yeah, but Bullseye. So Bullseye again, it had prizes that prizes were, were big. State of the art, like at Speed the time. Oh, like, oh, in that, but on that board, look, in one, in, in one. that section, they yeah. had stuff that you wanted, yeah. like yeah. video case oh, holders. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mate, you know them library-looking yeah. brown ones with the curve? Yeah. Mate, you the wanted draw. that or the burgundy one? Special draw for your video. Yeah. Yes. You, had, you wanted that. That you was in the prize board. I forgot prize about board. the prize board. You wanted the black and decker tool Stay out tool of the black and into the red. Yeah. Nothing in this game yeah. for two, two in the bed. Two in the bed. You wanted, yes. the, you, you wanted that lawnmower. Well, the you TV, wanted that mini TV vacuum. TV videos would be big. TV. A Ferguson video and yeah. TV. Yeah, TV. <laughs> you wanted that stuff, man. Yeah. And bully special prize. A caravan. A caravan, a, caravan, a, speed, a yeah. speedboat. Speedboat. Speedboats, man. You live on a council estate though. and they're offering you a speedboat. You're getting a speedboat. I don't know how it's working, but... but... What I liked as well with Jim Bowen, if, if you lost it, he'd tell you, look mm. what you could have won. Yeah. And he'd show you yeah. it all and you'd be like, oh, God. You don't want to see that, though. You don't want to see it, no. Go and have a look at it. Have a look at it. Go and have a look at it. It's the keys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go and have a feel. Jump in it, you can go. Turn the steering wheel now, get out. BF8, go on, bus fare home, go on. That was another one, yeah. You've won nothing but your BF8, your bus fare home. How about you remember you got the time it takes for the board to revolve? You remember yeah, that? yeah. <laughs> wrapping his hands. Yeah. Yeah. But do you know what? Do you know what? I, I think, again, that's another show that was on late, but then they moved it like near Police 5 and yeah, Smurfs you know, times. Yeah. yeah. They, they moved it around. They, they you know knew the, the kids liked it. It was around 5 o'clock. Yeah, they knew the kids liked it because Police when, when Bully would jump on the bus, I sure Adam yeah. would be in there, boom, 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 boom. Yeah. 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 
and you remember, you remember when people well, used to have, a, have a, a choice and it was like dictionary and had to spell something and, yeah. and William would walk yeah, across yeah, yeah, with yeah, yeah, a dictionary. Yeah. And Jim Bowen didn't have a clue how to spell it himself. So <laughs> we're just waiting for Bully yeah, to yeah, check yeah. it. Like, we'll and, and the production crew was like, it's not right, it's no, not, not right. right. No, you got that wrong. <laughs> you can see him <laughs> he's, he's looking around like, oh, fuck, fuck. I don't know how you fucking spell it. Look at that, he was a wicked presenter as well. It's the only thing I've ever seen him in. He'd never been in it. Yeah, but... Balls like, and he and he had cash in his pocket. Like, yeah, oh, what? Just, I'll just count it out yeah, during the what? break. I'll just oh, count what? out your cash. Yeah. Like, Don't go nowhere. I'm just counting these fivers. <laughs> just counting these pound notes. <laughs> super smashing great. Oh, great smashing super. <laughs> oh, oh mate, Jim Bowen is a legend. He, he was a He's wicked legend, presenter. That, 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 Bullseye is. That show, Bullseye. that show He's still was running. Him. I know it's on Challenge or whatever it is now. Yeah, yeah, you can't beat a bit of bully. You can still catch up. And what I loved about it is a nice balance. Someone knew the general knowledge and someone knew to play. Yeah, Simple yeah, as that. Yeah. The, the, there, there, was was a round, there was a round where the non-dart player had to go, and that's it. Yeah, yeah, that was at the end. You know, pub dart yeah, players, yeah, like, they were yeah. good. But you know at the end when the music all... And they're doing the darts. Remember that? Yeah. <laughs> and the non-dart player goes first. <laughs> 12, the big man, 12, you got to get 20 here, 20 here or more and you won the prize. Oh, and, and you knew, what you could have won. Yeah, but, but you knew the professional dart player was fuming at that yeah, point. That's, when, that's the time that. when you told the German knowledge fight, come on, man, when you knew yeah. it was coming on, you should have practiced all should've fucking weeks, yeah, man. you should have been practicing. This is bigger than yeah, any there's, final. There's no favours. the one with six darts. Yeah, but you know like in catchphrase, I go, Oh, we'll just give you five hundred pounds for the holiday yeah. too. Yeah. 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 Sorry for you. Yeah, but in bulls like no. no. Granada, in fact, I think it was Granada TV. Yeah. They weren't giving you no. You, no. you got your bully decanter. Yeah. You got your bully decanter. Bully. Your bendy bully. Darts. Here's your decanter. Here's your bully. Here's your bendy bully. And, and, he, and he stuffed the fibers <laughs> in the decanter <laughs> and with three darts. Yeah. I'm <laughs> fucking darts. <laughs> Twenty-five pounds each. Go on, yeah, in it. Go. Twenty-five pounds. I take it in my back pocket. Go on. <laughs> in it. Oh, it's mate. Wicked. Mate, yeah, bullseye. Bullseye was one of the best. Right? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'll take it out my That's own. That's what I'm saying. That's what it looked yeah, like. Yeah. It looked like that he was playing it. He went in his own wallet and he said... He made it look like yeah. that. Yeah. And sometimes, sometimes they tried to break the show down and have like Eric Bristow just do a thing. Yeah. For charity. Yeah, you remember yeah, like, yeah, yeah, they did. They always had someone coming for charity. <laughs> yeah, just, just, oh, just. They, just had, um, <laughs> they had like nine darts. Yeah. Yeah. This is for charity. <laughs> uh, mate, balls! I love that. So yeah, blind date, man. Blind date, date weren't per se like a game show win prizes. It's a dating, but dating, it was a, quiz. It was, it was a good dating though. quiz show yeah. where again you were judging who was ugly. Mm. You you were saying basically nah, that person ain't got the clout, mm. or that person's a joke, or that person's don't choose them. It was that. It was a first interaction of like you know reality TV is just yeah. rife now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back in them days, reality TV weren't rife because the only reality you had was that's life. Beagles yeah. about, Beatles about, mm. um, and sort of half scripted stuff. Yeah, really. Weren't and, it, and, it? and blind date and blind date was proper interaction. Mm. I can't remember when it first mm. come out. It was I'm sure it was just men picking women. It didn't. It did eventually swap, so the both sexes had to go. I think you sure. might be right. You know, I'm sure it was, was it? It was. It was I really sexist so. when it came out. Considering still women, was still a black. You still were still a black. Yeah, the first couple of series. I'm sure it was. She just was the first host of three, it. Right? One man, like there'd be three men during the show, one at a time, picking from three birds, and she'd be putting the birds down for most of it. Like, I don't know. I, I, well, I, 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 I remember the early ones were weird, and I thought this ain't. But gonna I said it's a first, it for years. first interaction of date, and like. You know, you, you come to these years and now it's naked attraction. Yeah. How oh, far oh, they've come. There's some weird ones now, man. <laughs> From dating to see someone naked on TV. I know. It's, it's I crazy. There was a, again, there was a voiceover guy. When it Was it her, Richard, or something? She, oh, my Richard, oh, or yeah. someone. No, and he used to come in. Blind day. Blind day. That dude, yeah. The voice Silla like, Black. Yeah. It, was it was Graham, good. wasn't it? His name? That's Graham, it. Graham, that was it. Graham. Ah, uh, Graham. Graham. Yeah. Here's our really Graham good. with a quick reminder. Yeah. yeah. And then you used to see how the date went the next day or the next week. That was the bit I liked, the bit where he used to Rate it sort of things yeah. and say the, what, what went on. Oh, yeah. Yeah, blind date, man. Blind date, man. Do you remember Paul Daniels doing a few quiz no. shows back in the I day? Do, I'm not a big Paul Daniels fan. Oh, no. I, so I didn't. I, yeah, I, I'm, I'm not. It's like when he used to do his magic stuff on. Yeah, I liked his yeah. magic. He, yeah, he, he was quite big. Him and the great the Soprendo. Old... Remember the great Soprendo? Great Soprendo. <laughs> <laughs> Remember the great friend? Yeah, yeah, actually, little fat Spanish kind of guy. Spanish looking dude, yeah, Mexican looking. But no, I used to like every second counts. 
with what Paul was Daniels. That, about? that sounds familiar. Was like, um, three sets of couples tried to win seconds to use in a final round to win a cash prize. <laughs> That's how it goes. <laughs> I can't remember what it was about, but it, I used to like it. I remember. What was it called again? Every second counts. That sounds really familiar. If you familiar. see it, if you Google it and see it, you'll theme tune everything you remember. He also done Wipeout. And odd uh, one out, which they were quite big. They, these were big out. Saturday night yeah. shows yeah. Like in the BBC 80s. BBC ones, weren't I think they? It was BBC ones, yeah. Every second count was 86 to 93. Um, odd one out, 82 to 85, and Wipeout, 94 to 96. Wipeout sounds familiar. Remember what? Yeah, I feel like I used good. to watch that. But one that stood out, like because by the time the night has come around, we weren't sitting in watching the show. These shows were part of our childhood because there was only one TV yep. and four channels. You know, most of the time, uh, most of the time, free channels. But what you know, once the night is come, you start raving and whatever, whatever. And so you wasn't in much. But one show you'd always come in to watch was Gladiators, man. Gladiators. Gladiators. The US, the US Gladiators. Remember, American Gladiators would come on yeah, late yeah, at night, yeah, yeah. about twelve o'clock at night. And, so, and people say, you see this new program, yeah, American Gladiators. Staying up watching, watching stay up that. late on a Friday night. You yeah. stay up late to watch American Gladiators, yeah. man. But then when UK got a hold of it with um what's his name? Oh Woo Gosh and, and, and Eureka Johnson. Eureka Johnson, yeah, I forgot about Gladiators that. Gladiators was was it's, it, it it was, was like big. a it was like a more of a um it was like Krypton fact it was it was, it was the bit in Krypton factor you wanted, but better. Yeah. yeah it's sort of course yeah. bit, but there's no questions to be asked, just pure physical Extra games and uh, Yeah, mate, what's your favourite event in Gladiators? I can't I can't really remember. I remember I uh, remember there was one hang, house hang the tough. usual thing. The, yeah. Joust, yeah, that was just no, no, joust. Was yeah. it that or the pugil? When he got yeah, the yeah, with the big got, cotton yeah. buds. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. The shadow was just the man that you, you didn't want to get up against. But mm. that, but that was a, that was a, that was a, um, an event that I liked. I liked that. Mm. I liked all. Oh, remember the one where you would like paintball thing. You would hide behind the yeah. wall and shoot with a cannon yeah. and try and hit the target. Yeah, the target. with the, yeah, that was the good. tennis balls. Or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah that, was that was Mate, I need the kind of American football one where you had to put the ball in the... Yes, yeah, so another guy that's trying to get you down, yeah. isn't it? Trying to rugby tackle you. Oh, the one, break, you know, like... So you like them all, so you don't want it all. <laughs> it's like his old show. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then you, at the end, you'd have the eliminator. That was big. That was what was the one where, like, the gladiators would have the long, like poles or whatever yeah and you had to run through all of them to get to the very end and they'd be yeah, mashing, they mashing you up you on the up. side yeah 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 I don't like know the name of that one but that oh, was good that, that was good yeah. the hang break, tough you mentioned that was, tough was very good that one was cool you know what gladiators was big it's a yeah, big it show yeah, yeah, but at the end after all show. those events as you're saying Chris the travelator and all that at mm. the end and the travelator again you could run out of steam. You could be you could be miles ahead. Be miles Again, ahead. that was the thing where, yeah. depending on how many points you got, you'd go yeah, first. You'd go yeah. first. Yeah. On my first whistle, blue will go. Yeah. On my, yeah, my second, second whistle. <laughs> <laughs> so you're running that, and the person that the, who, who went second could still win, but you could be still trying to climb up the travelator. Yeah, 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 you yeah. Caught yeah, up yeah. in the net or something. Yeah. Or, yeah. You, get travelator you, get caught, hard. you get caught trying to go up the wall, yeah, yeah. or you're stalling on the zip wire, trying to get your hands out around the zip wire. Mate, gladiator. But who's your favourite gladiator, man? The English ones. I don't remember any of the American names, but I, I remember Americans were like Nitro. I, I just remember in England, uh, Jet. Jet was the girl, wasn't it? Yeah. Jet, Jet was the only one you paid attention to, and Jet. I remember Rhino. Jet, Jet, it's just Jet, isn't it? Shadow, <laughs> Shadow, Jet, Rhino. Shadow, Jet, Rhino, Saracen, Wolf, Saracen, Wolf. Saracen. Wolf. You know, do you know Wolf, Wolf was, was the... you know Wolf was on the front cover of that game Barbarian. You remember the old Commodore yeah, 64 game? Yeah, yeah. I think he's he's the Barbarian. No on the way. Cover. Yeah, I think yeah. I heard that before. Wolf. Yeah. He used to do some like wolf, wolf claw look oh, on the yeah, screen, didn't he? Yeah. It? Trying to look. He scary. was he was the uh, the villain. He was a villain. He used to like grab oh. the mic off off the referee yeah, and throw yeah, it, yeah, yeah. And, and and get vexed. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no gladiators, man. There's also also another game, another kids game show I liked, man. Mallet's Mallet. Mallet's Mallet. Now Mallet's Mallet was the show. That only came on for your holidays. Yeah, in the six yeah. holidays, Christmas holidays, you'd see Wacker when, Day. Was it part of like GMTV or something? No, it's part of Wacker Day. It was just Wacker and Day. Ma and Mallet's Mallet will come on in between that. But it got so popular that sometimes it would just come on on in the mornings just, yeah, before you went to school. Yeah. Just that Mallet's Mallet. Mallet's Mallet. Mallet's Mallet. Mallet's Mallet. Mallet. Yeah. Word association game. Mustn't pause. Mustn't hesitate. Or you get bashed like, like this. Bash your head like this. <laughs> Look at each other and go blur. Look blur. at me and go blur. blur. Let's go. Word association. <laughs> Mate, Mallet's Mallet, man. Mallet's Everybody Mallet. knows Mallet's Mallet. It's a simple Mallet's game, Mallet. but it was fun to watch. Yeah. You get... Simple games are the best ones. Yeah. And, and, and all you got is a plaster. It yeah. said whack on it. Whack yeah. a day plaster or whack a plaster. Yeah. Like, yeah. It just said whack in, in biro. And just stuck yeah. it <laughs> Sometimes you'd be writing it there. Whack yeah. It. Whack. Here's your plaster. Here's your whack a day yeah. plaster. Yeah. Where'd you like it on your chin? Yeah. <laughs> 
Remember that? Sure. Wave it yeah, to the yeah, camera. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah. Wave your chin to the camera. <laughs> Mate, simple show. Simple <laughs> show. Do you remember a quiz show host called Lenny Bennett? Yes, oh, yeah. curly hair. Yeah. Curly hair. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Like he used to wear like like scott jumpers yeah. as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. He done two wicked shows. This is probably one of Did my... Did he do Celebrity Squares? Celebrity Squares, oh, celebrity I think, was one squares, of it. I like yeah. Celebrity yeah. Squares. Celebrity Squares was wicked, but I used to like Punchline. Ah, oh, how can you think not? For I never. Punchline. What was that show? Punchline. I remember the name. It was on ITV. Saturday wasn't Night it? Memory Game, where each celebrity would have See, their I, own and punchline, I forgot. <laughs> and contestant would try to remember um, the, the right punchline to a joke. I think so. Two celebrities they get told like a, a joke, and they've got. A, well, they, I think they got given the punchlines first, and they have to try and work out what goes with what. But I know it would always end up. The wrong way round or something. It'd be Punch some funny line. Punchline uh, was uh, what, really good. What year was that? Uh, 81 to 84, it ran. I love Punchline. I remember the Lenny Bennett dude. He'd done some other game shows, didn't yeah. he? Yeah. I he'd said he'd done well, Celebrity Squares. They, I think they sat in, in the same sort of set out as Celebrity Squares, like each in individual boxes. Yes. Yeah. There was there was a bit like that. And there was, um, you had to guess. It was a bit where they all got up and had to change around to fool the contestants. That's right. And he was like, get up and switch places. And yes. then he'd say to the contestant, Remember what you heard and where you heard it, or something. Right, to and then they have to now match. Yeah, the... match the punchline with right. where they think it is in the grid. But these were con celebrities sitting in a box. Yeah. I, I loved it. It was no, a wicked show. That. that was a sly one. That was a sly one. He, he like he done another one. Um, Lucky ladders. Lucky ladders. That sounds familiar. Was, I think this might have been a daytime one. I don't know if this was a. Uh, uh, it's definitely an ITV thing, but you were given like a, a start word and an end word, and you had to work out on a ladder. An N word. <laughs> you got you had a start word. What kind of show is this? And man? An end word. So you had a ladder. So you had the, the name at the top, a word at the top, and a word at the bottom. And you had to Do you say end? End word. Yeah. End. Yeah. What did you uh, think uh, I said? Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, is it? You got the N word. End word. <laughs> no, okay, end. okay, okay, sorry. <laughs> so yeah, you had a start word and an end word. And in the middle, you had to, you had to guess what linked them two words, if you know what I mean. Yes. Do you get, okay. what, do you get what I mean? Yes, yes, yes. But I used yes. to like that as well. I've got a feeling that was a daytime show, though. 88 to I night, remember actually. the title. Lucky Ladders. Lenny Bennett. Lenny his Bennett Lionel Scott back. jumpers, his Pringle just jumpers. Didn't have the yeah. big afro in, in no, Lucky Ladders. He, he had a haircut. Was I can't moving. remember how it looked, but I remember he had the big hair. Yeah, the Definitely Gene, did the Gene Wilder look. Yeah, yes, the Gene, yes, yes. Yeah, the Gene Wilder Lenny look Gene Wilder. on Punchline. Yeah, Punchline was wicked. Yeah, Punchline yeah. was wicked. Lenny Bennett. Yeah, he was wicked. So you know, we've gone for an abundance of, of 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 game shows, whether they be weekdays, weekends, um, evenings, children's shows, you know, big game shows. But what game show were you good at playing at? Out of all these shows, what show could you go? Yeah, I could go on that Ooh, show and I could cut home or something. That. Catch catchphrase. <laughs> Definitely <laughs> catchphrase. Catchphrase used to look so easy, but I'm, yeah. I bet if you were there, it probably wouldn't. Yeah. But I'd say uh, anything I'd give it general a go. knowledge. I'm sure I could do it. Anything general knowledge, I used to think, oh, I could go on this. So if you could choose, you choose any game show, it'd probably be catchphrase. It'd probably be Definitely. catchphrase. But saying that, who, nowadays, it'd be who wants to be a millionaire because of the prize. The prize and its general knowledge. Yeah. Yeah. But back in the day, catchphrase, I think. I think catchphrase, yeah. Mm. I think. Give us a clue. Give us a clue to be good as well. But, um, yeah, you can't go wrong with catchphrases. Catchphrases, you know? you're, you're, you're yeah. going to win you a bit of money, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. 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 Some decent phrase. money. You're going to win some more right, little yeah. Boat, boat, and a holiday a wedge out of that. Yeah, yeah. holiday. Yeah, that's so, yeah, true. That's true. Me, that's true. So, so which game show was your favourite? Would you say of all them? Just, just if they're all on at the same time. Yeah, which one are you going to watch? Just mentioning Punchline. Then I don't know, but I might go Krypton Factor. Yeah, that's a good show. Krypton Factor. I'm going to go. Price is right. Come on down. Price okay. is right. Da, 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 no, that's da, 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 play. That's, that's play, play your cards, cards right. right. Oh, You're saying price is right. right or generation game. One of them two. Yeah. I'd probably say play your cards right. You know, Family Fortunes. I love Family Fortunes. Family yeah. Fortunes is good. Okay, so if they could bring any of these game shows back, which one do you think they should bring back? I know catchphrase is still here, mm. but you know the ones that ain't here no more. I got punchlines. Since we just said it, I forgot all about punchlines. It was good. Blankety blank. Because yeah, I reckon with the much, comedians much, and the way things are just like allowed to run these days, you probably get a lot of jokes. Yeah. I, like... I think I think I think three, two, one. But I want to see what Dusty Bin would look like now. <laughs> what kind of bin they'll bring out now? <laughs> they'll bring out a biffer. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but he was a wheelie bin. 
He was the first. He come on wheels. Yeah. His feet were on wheels. He was, was he? I thought he was yeah. ripped in or something. Yeah, he wheeled yeah, in. He was like a trash can. Though. Yeah. But he was the metal, yeah, yeah. the original metal So I'd like to see what Ben they would bring in this time. Yeah. Yeah. So that would be interesting, man. So, look, that's our game show podcast, man. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as we did. I'm going to Google some game shows now. Yeah, go play some game shows, you know. Um, yeah. Just just some of the theme tunes. Just some of the... It, look, because what was lovely about it, I say the theme tunes, the hosts, the atmosphere, it, mate, it was entertaining. Like, when well, I used to watch some of these yeah. shows, I used to wish that sometimes they wouldn't end. They wouldn't end, yeah. I just want to watch them. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Who's the ultimate, ultimate host, then? Ultimate I'm host? Probably, for me, Bruce, Bruce. I think, or Bob Monkhouse. I think Bruce Forsythe. Is old Bruce my host. Is, I think look, they're all good in their own rights, right, yeah. but but he's done but, some wicked but ones. I'm just used to but going for so play long. cards right. Mm. Generation games yeah. insane was such, and many done strictly like yeah. later years. You know, yeah, um, yeah Bruce Forsyth's the definitely. Man. Yeah, he's a good good. But I've oh. got what I've got. I've got I've got one more actually. But was this a game show? Can this can this be in the game show zone? This is a weekday show, right? Wasn't the weekends. It wouldn't exist now, but you can just Google them. Michael Aspel was a big red book. This is oh, your this life. This is your life, life. yeah. This yeah. is your life. Not really a game show, but it I wasn't was a, a game show, it but good. it was it fits good. in with it, the game it fit show. It fitted in, it was in yeah, that it zone. In there, yeah. As I said, like, because that was where, again, that's when you got to know about a celebrity's yeah. life. Yeah. You got yeah. to know about their family. Again, and, you, yeah. It was one of the ones you were hoping it's someone it's good. So, but, hope it's someone I know. Hope it's someone from Star Wars. Yeah. I was always hoping it was Mr. T. I, w- yeah. I wish it was a bit because then you'll see the rest of the A team. Yeah. Sylvester yeah. Stallone yeah. might come on, <laughs> Apollo might come on, he's gonna you know, bring in Hulk Hogan them. might come on. It, it's just going to be the best one. We yeah. have Mr. T. You thought about that a lot. <laughs> mate, well, that's, mate, I watched that show every week. No, I did, yeah. I, and you would instantly was, think, who are they going to bring out? Gonna, who does he and, like, they would get them by surprise. They're like, they're, they're we've just thrown them in the, from yeah. the US or whatever. They'll just finish their like show, their Christmas show, and then Michael Aspel will walk up behind you with Big Red Book. Straight from the Palladium, straight off stage. He's come straight here in Mate, I say love that. And you remember the bit when <laughs> they'll be sitting and, they'll, and then Michael Apple will say, and do you remember this voice? Always said you'll make in Hollywood. Yeah, it's your old friend, it's your old teacher. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> and it'll come on and, and greet you. And, and remember, at the end, it will be someone. Give you the book. Yeah, but someone really special yeah, come at the end. Yeah. I know your wife was really special. Yeah. But someone who you ain't seen for years or someone coming at the, the end. The wife would already be there. Yeah, the wife is actually. even introduced yeah, her. She, yeah, she would have been the one there. that. Here's your wife up. and your yeah. children. Yeah. Forget them. But yeah. what about your <laughs> famous celebrity friends? But you ain't seen in 70 years. <laughs> Mate. And at, yeah, at the end, they'll bring us a big celebrity or something. Yeah, I always knew we'd make it. And, yeah, mate, and give you the big hench red book yeah. with your life. Yeah. Now, your now, life stuff you, in now, literally, you pick up your phone and let me know about that guy. Oh, right, yeah, I know. Wikipedia. Yeah, okay. yeah. <laughs> Wikipedia That's crazy. But done. we had to wait once a week, and we didn't even know who you're going to be seeing. Uh, you had to like, really it was gamble. Who are they going to show this yeah, week? Yeah. It's all like Nigel Havers or yeah. Judith Chalmers or someone. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? <laughs> but they weren't a game show, but it slotted <laughs> it next to give us yeah, a clue definitely. and all the rest this of them. Nice ITV, yeah. I think ITV this s- smashed life. it more than BBC yeah, because had he had its, had its yeah, program, but, but they didn't give yeah. you good prizes. No. And and ITV were, were more on, we're buying American shows and, and, yeah. and remixing them yeah. and making it into mm. a UK thing. Mm. So I think that ends our game show podcast, man. Yeah. That was a terrific retro journey, man. Going through all those shows, but again, I was totally saying forgotten. earlier, that's part of our childhood, man. Along with the cartoons and all the shows, you know, we loved a game show. You know, other than playing Connect Four and Hungry Hippos, we also yeah, loved yeah. watching a show. Loved it. I'm Mr. Lucas, Daz. I'm Chris. I'm Stax. Thank you for listening, guys. Please like and share. Please comment. Please tell your friends. Old school movement, man. <laughs>